Today is about her, not about me, okay? Everything is half off today. Yeah, I like it. Yay! <laughs> oh, I really love this. Honestly, with that top, I think too. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> How are ya? Welcome back to the channel. I'm still in Bernie today. Actually, today is such a special day. It's Mama Jancy's 60th birthday today. I cannot believe she's 60. People unironically ask me all the time, like genuinely, if she's my big sister. And I'm like, she is 34 years older than me. This is gonna be a special vlog. I'm trying not to film too much today on her actual birthday to just be present. She's taking a nap right now. So I'm gonna start the vlog now, but tomorrow is the big day because the number one thing she asked for for her birthday was for me to help her clean out her closet and then to go on like a little shopping spree to get her a new wardrobe for this new decade. So my dad's present to her was gift cards to the mall. And I also got her a couple things for her wardrobe as well. And I haven't given them to her yet, so I might try them on to show y'all what they are and how they fit because they are from Quince and I'm getting to work with Quince on today's video. When they reached out to me, I said, oh, wait, can I work with you for my mom's birthday video? Cause I wanna get her some of these pieces for her birthday. And they were like, sure, which is awesome. So I'll show you what I got her. Um, I'm wearing a Quince sweater right now. Tonight will be fun. We're just going to dinner. Jordy just left town. He has to drive to actually Searcy, Arkansas. His great, 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 great uncle founded it and there's a college there he's playing a college show he'll be back in a couple days but um so it's just me and the parents tonight and also i'm a little stuffy so sorry if my eyes look watery and if i sound funny i'm not sad i'm very happy actually i'm just stuffy before i get any of those comments <laughs> but let me show you what i got let's do a little let's do a little haul so I'll show you the things I got her, but I honestly rediscovered Quince recently when two things happened. First, I was scrolling TikTok and there is this therapist, unrelated to fashion at all, but she was wearing this cardigan. And I was like, I must know what cardigan that is. She was just talking about therapy things on TikTok. And so I scrolled and scrolled and scrolled until I found someone else asked her where a cardigan was and she linked it and it was this cardigan. So I was like, I have to have that. For the wedding, actually all the groomsmen shirts are gonna be from Quince because we were trying to find a linen shirt that wasn't super expensive. And we found one that is perfect for literally like under $30 a shirt for the groomsmen. They've essentially figured out a way to cut out the middlemen. They have like a factory direct model so that it's much more affordable. Their whole motto is like nice things accessible to all. So the price points are really good. Also, they care about sustainability a lot. So whenever they can use an organic material, they do that. They use environmentally conscious packaging. They're just very cool. So this is the Mongolian cashmere fisherman sweater. I cannot tell you how soft this is. So I got one for my mom as well. She likes warm tone colors. So I got her this kind of like oatmeal color. I'll show it to you buttoned up. I'm gonna link all these things down below. Those links do help to support my channel. So if you're considering any of these things, feel free to shop my links. But this one is just so comfy and cozy. Um, you can wear it open like I had mine on or you can wear it, I really like it buttoned and then kind of like tucked just so comfy. And then I got my mom some accessories, but I wanted to show you the one other sweater that I got for the beach. I actually sized up in this two sizes. I got this in a large because I've been wanting a super oversized knit sweater for the beach. So this is the Organic Cotton Fisherman Crew, but I'm excited for the accessories I got my mom. So I got her the cashmere sweater. Sling bags are so in, as you know, and having a leather one is perfect. So I'm gonna unwrap this before I give it to her, but I got her this leather crossbody sling bag, which I think is just so cute. I need to loosen the strap a bit, but it has two zippers on the front and on the back. And I think this is just a staple accessory that will help bring all of her outfits a little bit more contemporary and just be super practical. Something that she can wear every single day with all of her outfits, isn't it cute? And then she loses sunglasses a lot. So I got her these, like this. This is the shape she normally goes for. Here's what they look like on. So I think that will look really good on her as well. And then I couldn't help but get something for the upcoming travels. Cause y'all know I'm about to be packing for Paris. So I have this set of packing cubes. I think it's gonna be so perfect. I have some cheap, cheap, cheap ones that have ripped and not held up and these are nice. 
And then I'm still waiting on, I have ordered her some earrings from Quince as well. One is the Globe Boho Hoop and one is the Modern You Hoop. I'll put little pictures of them on the screen here so you can see them, but they're jewelry pricing is so good too. Thank you to Quince for partnering with me on this video. Thank you for having really luxurious things at a very accessible price point. Um, it's really fun for gifting as well. I know that mom's gonna be living in those things and I'm excited for tomorrow. I also got my mom a paddleboard because there's a little like pond in their neighborhood and she's always wanted to paddleboard it and it's so cute. She took it out onto the pool today to try to learn how to use it. <laughs> Just paddle boarding on the pool. One last thing to catch you guys up on. My dad and I did a dance class this morning and we have another one tomorrow morning because we are planning a little bit of a choreographed dance for the wedding. And that's all I'm gonna say about that. You don't get to know anything else about it, <laughs> but it's pretty cute. Um, so we might practice that a little bit more tonight as well, along with cleaning out mom's closet. So that's kind of, me catching you up to speed during her nap time, but tomorrow I'll be filming a lot more and maybe when she's awake, I can give her these couple things on camera so y'all can see it. But in the meantime, while I'm waiting for her to wake up, I'm gonna get more work done. Okay, you ready? First, a cashmere cardigan. What? This is from Quince. It's the brand I'm working with on today's oh, video. What? It's the same as mine, but I got you a warm color because I know you oh, like warm I colors. I do so much. And this then a couple accessories and a couple more on the way. These are just some sunglasses. Oh, yay. You might already have something kind of like this, but I thought this one looked really nice and like could kind of be dressy as oh, a little no, totally crossbody sling that you can like I totally wear to nicer dinners and stuff. Perfect. Yeah. This is an update, totally update to what I have, so. So that'll get you started and we'll do a lot more tomorrow. Ooh, so cute, wow. But today mom and I are gonna go clean out her closet and I'll show y'all some of the damage afterward, but I'm not gonna film too much today because today's about her, not about me, okay, okay. Okay, we just went through every single piece of clothing. She tried on every single pair of pants, the things that don't fit or she doesn't feel comfortable in or that she's, something she's been like, I've had this for 20 years and I think it's time. We've put it all here. Here's our donate pile. We're gonna go donate it all tomorrow. A lot of her date night tops, she thinks feel young because they're like pink and sparkly and ooh, you almost fell. So she just wants to get things that feel more mature as she's stepping into this new decade. And then we've pulled some shoes that she doesn't love or that are really, really worn and might we just might need to get like a newer version of them. So here's our list. Cute date shirts, probably a couple long sleeve, a couple short sleeve, wide leg jeans, a silky long sleeve top, um, a like mock neck loose sweater, some fitted tanks, jean jacket, dressy pants, like some trousers. Oh, silky skirt. She loves the silk skirt looks white layering tee, a layering turtleneck to wear under sweaters, maybe a blazer that is a little more, you know, modern long line could be kind of casual, dressed up, dressed down. She needs to replace her tan low heeled sandals because those are falling apart. Some cute sneakers to wear like out and about. So I said we should look at some vejas for her, some Mary Jane ballet flats, which I also want to look for as well updated black boots, and maybe some white pants are the things that we've decided could be good to look for. So we're going in with like a very specific plan. <laughs> Tomorrow's gonna be really fun. Um, but tonight I am going to do a little bit of work, help her clean all this up, and then we're gonna head on out to dinner. So I'll just bring my phone along and get a couple dinner shots, but it's gonna be pretty fun. Also, I blew my nose too hard and I can't hear out of my right ear at all, and everything sounds crazy. <laughs> Hello. Cheers. Happy birthday. <laughs> Happy birthday to you, Kayla. Happy birthday to you. And then at least 64. You're only halfway through your life. Yeah. Good morning. It's the big day. Dad and I are about to leave for our dance lesson. Ooh, earrings. Ooh, camera falling. Are you okay? 
We are going straight from the dance lesson into San Antonio to do the shopping for mom. So I'm wearing the new oversized sweater that I got that's so comfy and just jeans and I'm probably just gonna bring my boots and change into them after the dance class. Um, but it's gonna be a very fun filled day. I'm really looking forward to it. Mom has a couple gift cards to random boutiques in San Antonio that I've never been to that she wants help figuring out how to spend. So we'll be going to some random stores, but I've also convinced her to stop by the mall on the way so that we can get her some basics, especially shoes. She really wants shoes and I still haven't exactly found my wedding shoes. I have options. I just feel like I could do better and I have to have it finalized in a couple days because I have my dress fitting in a couple days. So I'm hoping to stop by the mall, look at some shoes for both of us and then go deeper into San Antonio and go to those couple boutiques. That's kind of what's on tap. I think we're gonna do a liner at a spot she wants to go. Looking forward to it. I'm striking out for wedding shoes, but looks like mom found some things. Well, what did you find? I found lots of boots to run by you. I, I want a higher ankle for you. Okay, there are some of those. Oh, let's see. They are higher. That one's better. Actually, feel comfortable with that high of a heel though? Oh yeah. Really? Uh-huh. Well, that's potential for sure. Ooh. I like those. You do? Yeah, the heels are really fun. I think those are really fun, especially with like a wider leg jean, which we'll get you today. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Cute. Mom mind. specifically wants some more like date night type things, so I found her these leather pants that she might she might not like, but um, slash the small size they have I think might be a little big on her, but that could be a fun date night pant. And then I also really like this dress. I feel like it's modest for her age, but like a really pretty color. Kind of sexy all at the same time. So I'm going to grab her one of these. As expected, they're a little too big, but we should put these on the list for things to look for because they're really cute and such a good date night thing. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Okay, we're moving on to the mall. The boots that mom found were a sale on clearance, so they were 30 bucks, which is pretty great for what were they normally? Probably over $100, maybe even over $200. Good job, high five. And now we're making it to the mall. This is where I grew up going. It was kind of fun to see it all decorated for Christmas. Gonna do made well, maybe free people, and then see where we get from there. Is this with heels and like a like this top, honestly, that you're wearing, that you're wearing would be so chic. <gasps> I can't wait to see this. Everything is half off today. They're a little big. With some heels. Uh -huh. Yeah, let's see if we can find you. Oh, that might have been the smallest that they have, yeah. but maybe online. Yeah. Oh, I really love those. Honestly, with that top and some heels. I do too. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> we found we found the fit for mom and they do free hemming. So we're going to get them hemmed, but those are so cute. We've made it to the fancy side of the mall. We're not going to go in places like that, but there's a Starbucks. We might get a little Christmas drink. I kind of hope they have the eggnog latte. Also, this side of the mall is so quiet. Shh. It's expensive over here. Shh. <laughs> See the pants on the top you just found. Ooh, yep. Honestly, together, those could really work. We're finding date night things. I think that's so cute. You also don't have much in this color. Yeah, you always go color. towards green, towards yeah. warm. And this and is actually such a color of the year. I feel like. Yeah. It oh, it looks so cute on you, especially on camera. <laughs> what? It's so cute. Um, it's so cute. Sixty. So I don't know. Yeah, but you're a hot sixty. <laughs> We're running out of time here before the spot she has a gift card to close. So we're quickly sprinting through anthropology to see if we can find any other date night shirts. But we did pretty good. That's really fun. <gasps> Why do I love this? That is very you. Oh. <laughs> oh. Do you want that? No. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> I found you a date loofah. Yes. So age appropriate. <laughs> She doesn't believe me that this is cute, but somebody my age just walked in holding it, so I think that that's proof that it's cute. For your age. <laughs> I, you're cute. Especially with those loafers, I feel like it's a cute look. Cute look. Yeah, and it's a layering piece. We're at a little boutique now that mom has gift cards to. Honestly, I mean, not with that high of a neck undershirt, mm -hmm. but I kind of like that. It's kind of blazer, it's kind of cardigan because the material's a knit, right? Is uh -huh. it a knit? No, not quite, but it's very soft. Mm -hmm. I think that that could be dressed down for the beach or dressed up for like something businessy. Mm -hmm. Picture it with a different neckline because 
that shirt underneath is a bit too high of a neckline. But honestly, with those pants and those shoes. Okay. Yeah. Pretty cute. It's a contender for your gift card. For sure. <laughs> okay. Y'all have to tell me if you like themed vlogs like this, where it's, you know, the Disneyland vlog was a themed vlog, and then shopping with mom for her new 60th wardrobe is a themed vlog. I don't have too many of these planned in the near future, but um, if it's kind of fun to have a theme, let me know. We can start doing these a little more often with just like kind of a focus, no matter what that is. Could be fun. We're in this really beautiful boutique. That is so overpriced. Mom has a gift card that I don't think covers a single thing here. <laughs> look, 30% off sale. Maybe we look here. We might have done it. We might have found something for her to spend her gift card on. And it's almost the same price as her gift card. Those are really cute. Very cute. Oh, yay. And I have my little kitty corner over here. <laughs> I told her it's like, entertains your kid while mom shops. Kind of like it. <laughs> what a successful day. How do you Such feel? A, oh, so good. You All got you got pretty shop. much, well, pretty much everything on our list. Mm -hmm. We like went in with a plan and we really stuck to it. You got some yep. date night shirts. You got some new pants. Yep. You got a new blazer. Mm -hmm. It's pretty fun. So and now we're going to go eat some fish together because mom does not get to eat fish when I'm not here because nobody else in our family likes seafood. Yep. So it's just the two of us. We go get some seafood. So I'm going to leave the camera in the car and we're going to get some some sashimi, some ceviche, some oysters, something raw. I love me some raw fish. Um, I forgot to end off the vlog yesterday, so my lip gloss exploded. I will just cue you in on what's happening today because it's actually a really fun, sweet day. I am going into Bernie. Kaylee's and Anna are bringing their babies. We're gonna have a little Bernie lunch, maybe walk some of the shops, depending on how the babies do. And then tonight, Jordy gets back into town. We have premarital counseling and we pack up because tomorrow we go to Austin. I wanted to say thanks for coming along on this vlog. I know it was like not a normal vlog, a lot of the same of just like shopping and doing whatever, but I really wanted to be able to celebrate mom and treat her for her big 60th birthday and help her get out things that she loves. So it's fun to get to combine filming with also treating mom and making her feel special and doing what her big wish was for her birthday. Um, Cause I swear that woman, she never shops for herself. The things that she has were like gifts from me and Jacqueline. She does not shop for herself. So the fact that she got gift cards from dad and other places as well, and kind of like was able to guilt free, just go get a whole haul was really sweet. And she loves her things from Quince as do I. So I wanted to say thanks again to Quince for partnering with me on this video. I'm gonna have all those pieces that I showed you linked down below in addition to the couple jewelry pieces too. And this was a really fun, <laughs> clothes focused video. And the next, you know, honestly, the next month of videos will be very adventurous. Um, you're about to get five European vlogs in a row. So it's kind of fun to do something like this before we're out and um, probably just trying a lot of pastries for a while. On the days I don't vlog like today where I want to be present with Anna and Kaylees, uh, always go follow me on Instagram. I share little bits on of my non-vlogging days over on Instagram pretty consistently, pretty frequently on my stories just because it's easy. And that's it. I'll see y'all probably in Austin, but if not, back in San Diego. I love you. Bye. So let's take all right